more context. I'm an Indian citizen with a green card living in the UAE, but I could not travel to the US in 2020 and 2021. I finally got my green card reactivated and traveled to the US in 2022. Right. Okay. So consider a green card. A green card is kind of like a, a re-entry permit. Look at it like that. So my point is that even though your green card may have expired or you may have lost it, as long as you didn't properly surrender it to the comp a competent authority. So, for example, an embassy or someone at CBP Customs and Border Protection, and they give you an I-407, so you did not properly surrender that card, you still remain a U.S. taxpayer. Even if it's lost, even if it's stolen, even if it goes through the washing machine. I've seen them all. I've seen the green cards go through the <laughs> washing machine. The clients bring them to us. So we've seen them all. So regardless of this, this the condition or the expiration of the physical card, you are still a U.S. taxpayer. So yes, you need to make sure that you're up to date with your taxes. And that may include either going through the, the voluntary disclosure, which we discussed earlier for someone whose non-compliance was willful, or the streamline, which we discussed earlier for someone whose non-compliance is deemed to be non-willful. I hope that helps. So if you're a six, seven, or eight-figure investor, entrepreneur, or business owner who needs a tailor-made solution from a qualified team of professionals, we can help you achieve the international lifestyle, the freedom, and even the tax savings you're looking for. Visit us at htj.tax and live that international life.